So here we have two uh, identical Scout X4s. F12 of the um, Sports Edition radios. One of the uh, Scouts has been upgraded with the uh, dual GPS. It's just a test to see the difference between locking and the number of satellites acquired between a upgraded and non-upgraded version. So binding the, uh, this is the non-upgraded version. And now the upgraded version. So now we wait. Ah, my battery warning. And the radio. Damn. We'll, uh, we'll wait for that for a while. And there's the uh, upgraded version. Already acquired two satellites. Or two blips. The standard version that uh, was powered up earlier. Still nothing. An alarm that's going off on the right hand transmitter. There's a low battery warning in the transmitter. Just need to charge your batteries in it. As you can see, the upgraded, uh, the upgraded version, five clear um, blips, which means it's it's uh, too clear of minimum required for, for attitude hold, and the other, it's still yet to get a lock. It's uh, it's pretty hopeless on the standard Scout uh, GPS. It really is quite hopeless and in fact quite dangerous. I've, uh, I've had two flyaways in this particular model. Both of them were showing three blue blips and sitting in at altitude hold uh, when it just completely lost satellite connection. Showed no blips and it just flew away in uh, one case quite violently to a point where I couldn't recover it and it ended up in a crash. So there we go, highly recommend upgrading your GPS on the Scout. It's not really a usable model to fly in GPS mode without the upgrade.